Hello everyone, this is Nancy. Welcome back to our live tutorial. It's brought to you by Glitz Accessory and such. Happy Monday. Hope everyone have a great weekend. Today is gonna, I don't have a nail to show you because it was on Isabella, my daughter's hand. And if you miss it, you can absolutely be watching them from our IGTV and Facebook page or as well as on um, YouTube. Hello, Laurie. Hi, uh, Janae. Hello. Hey, Supplies Una. Hey, Rosie Nails. Thanks so much for tuning in. Hello, hello, everyone. Happy Monday. Hope you all have a great day. Thanks so much for even like stopping by or hop in. Remember to check out our IGTV for so many free live tutorial or short clips or long like phone tutorials. So there are a lot of tips and tricks from fusioning, 4D gels, gel painting, crystal placement, charms placements, uh, liquid and powder, dipping powders, and you can see them all. And then so many more tutorials going to be on your ways as well. So today I prep the nails i did my nail actually i feel it instead of hello bella hello hey Janae. hey uh Mari. so hello taisha hello how are you hi mama big so i feel that but then in the future we're definitely gonna have tutorial for like um uh poly gels as well as a lot of others, more liquid and powders, dipping powders on the way. But then I'm going to show you the quick look on this hand. I'm going to save this to doing it uh, a 3D hand crab roses on both hands. If you want to see how I do my um, non-dominance hand for my dominance hands. I really just, like want to do it all for you to seeing it. Maybe on some of tutorial doing along, it's fun to do this hand because that's how this one look. But it's gonna be rose here for you to see more dramatic, like more fall nails, and it's so simple, easy, quick. If you are a nail technician or you are watching because you adore, you know, want to be doing your own nails, or um, if you are beginners or going to school, so here. Is gonna be like this if you put two fingers together so it's really simple you can absolutely as the nail technician you can do your nails like this if you have some fun nails during um hey Corina hi Jackie hey hey thanks so so much for tuning in and you can absolutely achieve this look it's really simple like if you are really busy at the salon you don't have time for yourself you can absolutely create some of fun design using really trendy newest collection of um, butterflies or chanfo foil is really bring nice look on your nails without taking a lot of your time. Well, because you know why? Because you're already pro, so you know how to doing it. Not like necessary for all the clients, but then there's something that you can do so then you don't have your nails to be naked seeing your clients because your nails is your advertising and your nails speak a lot about your works as well. So let's start with this. Now I might doing this one um, along with this to doing rows. And I can't, I'm so obsessed with this that I'm gonna do is handcraft, um, handcrafted butterflies. This one I have uh, stickers on, but this one I will do it with this butterflies on my thumb so then you can all see it. Hey Debbie, how are you? Hi Mama V, hi Nene, hey. Hey Bella. Hey Dom, hey, uh, Mrs. Handsome, hello, Nacho Nails, hey, hello, hello. Thanks so much for tuning in. Happy Monday, everyone. Hope you all have a great weekend. We have so many things is coming on the way, so um, get ready because we're gonna have a lot of cool tutorials. So, and then we're gonna organize a little bit difference and we're gonna have a schedule of what day we're gonna do, like for instance, it's Monday, do acrylic, and next day we'll be dipping. And then uh, Wednesday, like Tuesday, we're dipping. Wednesday will be gel painting. Uh, Thursday will be 40 gels. And Friday will be fusioning. And maybe Saturday Q&A. So, and also, we are going to have a virtual church show coming on the way. So, please stay tuned for more information and a lot of gifts and a lot of special promotion. So, Hey, uh, Mutalov, how are you? 
Okay, so let's do this. This one actually we are using with, um, I using this is not liquid and powder, it's a poly gel. So definitely I would love to share with you if any of you are doing heart gels also and, and um, transitionings and then still or added on service on your salon with the poly gels, you can absolutely is achieve the same looks as acrylic. I'm so obsessed with this and then we're gonna definitely doing tutorials in the futures. So let's get started with this. And I have a collection of um, all of newest butterflies. Well, the, all of our collection of butterflies is so fun to do. And this one even a lot of fun because the butterflies keep getting bigger and bigger. So I am going to um, do using this one and this one. Maybe this one because I have some smaller one. However, you can do something that's really fun with pink, purple, and uh, butterflies. Oh, purple, I well, was thinking of Eric's that he would do and like purple is really nice. And also, there's a lot of more. Maybe next set I should do this. So it doesn't matter as whatever is season of the year, you will never go wrong with butterflies. And it's so, it's getting better and better with a lot of things. And I also have a super cute, it's like a 3D um, a metal artist. I'm gonna put it along with our rose, handcraft it. I'm so upset with this. Maybe I put her in here. We'll see how things go and then we'll go from there. Okay. So this first start, if you see that I have a little bit hint of shimmery, I did use this, our newest uh, no wipe top coat with glitter effects and just shimmery glitter, but it's no white. Like if the client's getting it done and they don't want any anything's on it and it says, I, but I just want to be hint of a little bit shimmery. For instance, if you have solid colors, you didn't have any of like um, glitters on it. You can add, absolutely add this one on and it make it so stunning and cool. I believe it's a rose gold over there. This one I am using is silver. It's hollow silver. I'm doing this. The reason is give me effects of the little shimmery holo and plus is will absolutely adhere the um, sticker so much better. I'm gonna keep it just a little bit like 30 seconds. And hey, Kushio, how are you? Hey, hey, Eric, we're just talking about you regarding to the butterflies in the purple. So glad you're tuning in, love. All right, so I am going, maybe I will do, hold on, let me move this. Just have to see my nails in there. Okay. If you want like more glitters, you can absolutely add one more coat. But I just want really hint of it, and then I will add um, butterflies on it. But I'm telling you, if you have your nails done like this, it's not only make you feel so good, also is impress so much of your clients. They see that doesn't matter. They might pick one of your nails as this um, nail art on the nails because they can see that you weigh in person. So I'm so excited with this. Probably this is the, I think this is a set, the first set, the only set that I have with no like bling out crystal. I almost like show everyone I remove it and feel this but then we let it surprise for its upcoming uh, arrivals. But crystal is still on my nails even though I remove it. It still stay really, really strong on it. So I move that. Just a little bit of shimmery is hollow so if the client one says you don't have to worry about if you don't have like for instance color acrylic glitters uh, or if you don't have a like shimmery look like this 
this is perfect and if the clients don't want anything else you key it it's good to go because there's no wipe you don't have to do anything else so i'm going to probably doing it 30 seconds and then i will take some of this i put this two butterflies but you can do different colors you can do pink you can do blue these two are really stunning as well you can do it together and then pink this one is like her pink yellows and then this one is has like pink super cute i picked this for the fall but you can do anything it doesn't have to be and then it's on the pinky i using two little ones there so it's gonna be really fun simple oops sorry instagram i think i got it off instagram right here pink okay good all right so we're gonna choose this I'm gonna take this one. The biggest one. Can you see it like that? The better. Yeah. Using my tweezer, one end I pick and remove the sticker off from that sheet. And the other ends I can like press it firm to make sure that it's staying on. It's fun to do your own nails. It's kind of a little bit challenge because if you first or if you start doing it, you might feel like Okay, so I'm gonna line them up next to each other. But it's so much fun because you not only take care of yourselves, get your nice, nice nail done, and also a lot of fun things that you uh, go discover when you're doing your nails. Some new techniques you learn. Maybe I see more. So it's really like stay grip amazing on that. All right, cool. And then I'm gonna put pumpkin spice on this, like that one. But if you can, if you don't want it, you can put any colors on. You can put green. You can put brown or black colors. Doesn't matter. And let's go into the smaller one. I got smaller. Let me see if I'm looking for the smaller one. Again, from here. Can't do that. A little bit tricky. Really nice with that smaller one. Get another smaller one. It's gonna be so much fun. She looks like the big. Do you have another one smaller? Can you find me the smaller one in here? The, um, 
Oh, I found one. I found one on this collections. Uh, not okay. quite. I'm gonna check this, the newest one, right there. It's so much fun when you do this and the clients see it. They will definitely like, oh my gosh, I want, and you have the nice nails done. Clients see it. They were absolutely excited about this. And this tweezers is everything, look. It's staying flat on it. And then I will show you how you can able to absolutely keep your butterflies with no like edges coming off. But we did have a top coat, shimmery top coat on first. So it's not only give it effects of underneath. I don't want to put it over on the top of the butterfly. It's going to make it a little bit too um, busy. You want to see some detail from butterflies. So I did it underneath, and also if a really good uh, purpose of keep them nice and smooth surface, so then when you place your um, sticker on it, it will not give you a hard time. So let me see, it's going that way. You don't have to get a match. Uh, you don't have to get matchy matchy. You can do match and match. You can do different colors on a different hand, or you can do different. Um, like totally colors you don't have to do this kind of a fall look okay that's going that way hold on do i miss any color Hey, nay, nay. Thank you, nay, nay. That's it. Super simple, easy. Let me see, what did I do with them? All right, so I'm gonna save this one instead of getting another half of the butterflies but I will do this butterfly because a lot of you request to see a 3d handcraft flower so here you go we absolutely gonna do that with our uh, metal art butterflies a little bit of flat 3d so now I am go ahead and using condensed glue gels this is everything you will keep your sticker it doesn't matter your stickers um, anything or encapsulating stay in one place so i am going to need my tinted brush my forever tinted brush is i have it for a long time thanks to the cap of the brush so it keep my um brush is staying nice and it's protected from getting um like here under LED light, so it's kind of, I think it's enough. So I'm gonna apply this one too. I am going to do two at the same time because I wanna light up that two butterfly to get half of it. Make it look like a butterfly together. Two half, I guess. Well, if you are doing with the clients, you can do like four, three of them together, but try to do this one last or do this one, the thumb first, and then you can do the rest um, after because you don't want to have uh, all five of them done at the same time because this one, when it's like laying on this, it might shifting a little bit. The crystal might shifting a little bit during the time you're doing it. so. Close that and I will need no wipe top coat. If you now, if you do matte finish, you can go ahead and put the matte top coat on. But if you want shiny, then you go ahead and do shiny. Here's a matte. So if you don't want matte, then you do shiny. If you want, you know, like 
shiny than the blue map. Oh, hey, Adela, thanks so much. Thank you, thank you. Where's my top coat though? Mm -hmm. Open it. Oh, right there. So you just folding, floating on the top of the condensed, unkeyed condensed glue gel. So I will do the top coat on the second one and third ones right after I finish with crystal placement. So I'm gonna get pumpkin spice and some of my frame from metallic disc frame to make it like her antenna. Hi, Fire, how are you? Hey, hey, hey. So I have it right here. I don't know where I'm at. So I will get size SS12. It's not the biggest one, but the good size for yeah, super cute. Oh, it's like SS12. Let me see how many I put on. So total is six. I put it right in the edges like that. And I'm gradually getting the size smaller, size so SS12, 10, 8, and then like six eight six it doesn't matter whatever size you want you can do a bigger one absolutely it looks super cute though never have too much crystal too many crystals or too much room I think I got that right. And then if you want her, I'm doing a shorter right here to match it with this. So great. I am going to do a no wipe top coat again. And I'm gonna do it on this. Second nails. This is so much fun. Just take some time if you are like seeing your clients every day. Just take some time, about an hour or two, to take care of yourself, like self care. So you get a nice set of nails. So you always feel happy. And plus, that wherever you go is advertising for your business. Now you can be stop at like gas station. Well, it's not like it used to be before, like people still see your nails anyway. If you go to the store, they're not gonna get closer to you like it used to be before because of COVID-19, but they're still able to ask and you can like hand on the business card. I'm like, yeah, it's done by me. Come see me at ABC salons. You know, we do all different fancy nail art and all different sort of um, custom nails. And here is the coupon. I don't know if you have coupons, like for first time or not, it's depend on your salon, but it's one of the marketing's way you can absolutely get your names out. Um, because we always continue building a clientele. Like say if you have a client that being um, loyal to you for so many years and then now they are in military for instance they move or they somehow some way they move things change you know so you always continue building a new clientele but don't get that so you put it together let me sure it looks like there you go sorry i couldn't see that all right 
Hey Daisy, how are you? Great. And I'm gonna do this one and we are going to cure it. I already have condensed glue gel for all of you just tuning in. Here's a condensed glue gel, but I applied on, um, you know, the index, the middle fingers, and then the pinky. So now I am going to apply the no wipe top coat. So. And I'm gonna find really smaller size, probably size SS3 and then SS. Uh, four or five it's a good decent size but it's not too small and I'm gonna get a little bit space between them so it's, you can still see the butterflies I'm sort of connecting that crystal together How's everyone doing today? I'm so excited to see you all. A lot of you were asking for the sticker. You wanna see stickers for butterflies? And then 3D. So that is not gonna be able to like, uh, the crystal, uh, the sticker will stay on without it, you know, Coming off, so I'm doing like have a zigzag like this, like an edge shape. Okay. You don't have to do matchy matchy, but if you want to, oop, I think that one is slides off or it's just somehow is hidden. Or maybe I touch it, I didn't realize it, I'm not sure. But it's really cool though, because this will not key until you are key under LED light so then if you need to adjusting it before you cure absolutely so I'm go ahead and cure this nail uh, this hand for 60 seconds and then adjusting that there you go be careful here's a look and we're gonna put some uh, 3d I like this one a lot too. We're debating between like um, uh, purple or yellow. Big one. But let me show you something. Maybe tomorrow we're gonna do something like that. Um, can I grab that? Can I grab that? Yeah. Hey, I keep get her off from my Instagram. I'm sorry. So look at what I want to show you tomorrow. In the meantime, we're waiting for this nail to be done. Look at this. I can't wait because I'm so obsessed with the big one, the newest Chanfer Foy, and with another huge butterfly. It's from the big one to the smaller one. This is so cute. I think I should chant first right to my hand. It's super cute and big because for all of you who do custom set, like a long nails, this is gonna really fulfill your um, creativity. Look, it's so real. And it's also come with tiny little cutes like a black and white. This is holo butterflies. This is the black ones and then this is the white one. So it's good size for the sm smaller, shorter nails. And this is so cool. I can't wait. So tomorrow we're gonna do a long nails. Long nails or short nails? Look at that. <laughs> it's so big and it's super cute. It looks so realistic. Sorry, I can't wait because I almost doing this today, but I have a lot of requests for the stickers and 3D. So we're gonna definitely do this one. It looks super cute. Do fusioning and do that one. This is the newest one, newest collection. And it's so nice, it's clear. So you can transfer on any background colors. Doesn't matter whatever background, you can do pink, you can do purple, you can do yellow, you can do um, orange, 
Like this one looks good with kind of an orange or fuchsia names in the backgrounds with the blue teal turquoise uh, ombre. This one is really cute. Like you can cut it in half and do one on one big thumbs and the other. Or the clients getting a pedicure, they can get that on the big toes as well. And doesn't matter, you don't have to chamfer completely. You can do like part of it. It looks super cute as well. This one is everything. I almost want to do that once on my this one but if you want half this you can cut half this and put one on this thumbs and the other on the other thumb to get it match okay so i can't wait because as you can see that it's clear so you can put in any background you want and i am can't like wait so definitely um how they, how they are big. I really want to see it. Uh, Adela, do you want to see it? Hey, Adela, good. How big it is. It's really cool and really big. You know what? You can do it on that two nails. Super cute. Aha. You can cut in half like half of it and you can chamfer on two fingernails or you have little ones so they are smaller size they are bigger size on each um like rows of chamfer foil like this so you can have option of do smaller or bigger or medium size and it come in black white purple pink um turquoise blue yellow which one do I miss? Brown? Well, so it's a lot. It's so much fun to do. Let's go in having fun with our 3D uh, handcrafted flowers. So I have, of course, this one for any of you just tuning in. Hello, Capri. How are you? Hi, Fiala. How are you? Thank you. Thank you. Um, yes. Uh, definitely, Lori's. We wanna definitely gonna share with you tutorials for the forty gel, uh, for the poly gel. This is done all by poly gel, so um, once at a time, like that. So let's go. So do I miss anyone's in there? On uh, if I miss anyone's on Instagram, I am so sorry. Because I can only see so much and it, the, the, the windows only let me see like five comments and then it keep, it's just like um, gone before I even look it up and see it again. So I'm going to get a big like amount of condensed glue gel. Wherever you want to put it. So I might want to do it right here. get a little bit more because I am going to put some um, butterfly and some of my 3D uh, crystal you're gonna see that is a new year's collection of the 3D pointed back or you can do with the um, acrylic charms flowers so cute too there's few of them I pick few of them but there will be a collection of all different colors so you can do it for Christmas um, any seasons any like seasons of the years any time of the year so I am going to get that rose and a couple of butterflies maybe I should use my teaser super cute and I will keep you posted how long I can keep this. I think it's gonna be so much fun. All right. So let's see. 
I'm gonna do it like a shield cover it's heavy and you can always edit on more right after I flash key it I'm just want to do it quick here and then I'm gonna flash key this one This one is so cool. Oh, it's weird because, okay, let me do this and see how it is. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do it like that. It's gonna be much better. I'm gonna flash key it quick and then we're gonna decorate it more okay because it's under the light we keep um shift a bit adjusting it can you wipe this one off quick oh in the meantime before I put it on I'm gonna do this quick 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 can you see it from Instagram Sorry. okay I'm gonna really 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 and place this under the LED light. Because I move my hand, that's how it is. How like it? Swing that thing and fly out. <laughs> this is that thing on the fly. Sorry. This is so weird. Alright. Okay. Let me hear this. Can you just stop being frustrated? This is my own nails. I know, but like, just flash key before you start playing. It's around. okay. This is how a live, real life, it's happened, right, ladies? We just have to try to figure it out. And, <laughs> and I'm the ones doing it. I'm not frustrated. Why you worry about it? Man, take it easy. It's our nails. We can do whatever we want. Hey, Ryan. Hello, hello. Okay, so because I keep moving my fingers and I'm just adjusting it. So I'm gonna flash key and I'm gonna show you what's going on with this. So the last time I caught it. How cute it is. So now I just flash key it quick. And I am gonna add more condensed glue gels. Nay nay. <laughs> Alright, so I am going to using my pickers. So I'm gonna go in between. I know it could be sometimes it could be frustrated. I think more for people watching it than me doing it. I'm cool with that because like Kevin, you know what to expecting. That's why you cool and then you calm and people are watching. Oh my god, they're falling. Or it's just well I gotcha. So 
so you can do like flowers and flash key at first and then move on to the next one I'm going to add more here I'm gonna add some beads on and So here something is remind like it really cool because I always tell the clients like I say oh my god can you do your nails? I say yeah but struggling you know like how our all the nail tech was like really OCD of you can unless you know some of your bestie doing really really good the way you want it you want to let them doing it but yourself you try to do it yourself because that's the way you want it. So then I told the clients that, you know, it's really fun, but it's hard. So it's just good to have someone else doing it for you instead of you trying to do it at home. It's still like impossible. I'm going to add it more because I'm not doing more crystals. Adding here and Condense Goja. So then that way, just in case I want some more stuff on that. And no wipe top coat again. Now you put the no wipe top coat. Yes, Adela, we definitely gonna save this video on Facebook and Instagram. You can absolutely watch it later. Well, have a good night. Adela, thanks so much for uh, tuning in. This one has a lot. So I will definitely, when you do this for the clients, make sure you have the clients like tilt back and forth. That is super cute. I really, really like it. I can still adjusting it because I'm flash cute for 10 seconds. So, add more butterflies. Right. And I will get some beads from here. From my... I just spilled whole entire tray earlier. So... Okay, I have some more to use it. I need this amount of beads on. It's beautiful for angle, lot, lot from the angles right here, Lori. Awesome, I'm so glad you ladies like it. Can you get me the different tray? Look at that. No, I meant uh, this. More beads. I might add her over here too. More butterflies here. And more beads for my acrylic. This is acrylic um, flower charms. It's so cute and stunning, and I absolutely adore it. All right, let's see what we are. We'll be having more now. I'm gonna do more butterfly. I'm so upset with this. It's not flat, it's like curved. You see that? There you go. So it's go right in between the flowers for me. You know, it's not only decorated, it is also support your 3D so much. I love it. How is this techniques we're doing it? And I, all my crystals in 3D clusters, ported back will last so much longer. Uh, okay. More. This is dramatic fingers. This is so fancy. Uh, the beats. I can do another one. Um, I'm 
probably can feed another pumpkin spice right there. So it mean in under all the different angles, it looks so cute. It doesn't look just like plain flower from the top. You can see that all surround with the rose is covered by butterflies and crystals. Let me know if you are playing with this and then doing your own nails. I would love to see your beautiful pictures. Hair door. Um. Hey, Kucho, thank you. I'm going to add the crystal on there. Can you see it from here? So super cute. It's like super dramatic. You can add crystal or you can add more beads, which is I'm gonna find some beads and put it in there. Continue to add some more pumpkin spice. You do not have to do it if you don't want to. But if you do, you can bling all the way out. And I will keep you posted with how long I can keep this. I protect it so well, so it's not gonna easy. Hold on. Now I can turn it because it already protects so well. When you're doing it, just um, make sure you key it for like 10 seconds first to the point that you can able to adjusting it. So I use a lot of uh, size SS5 and 6. You like it now? This, the flower is really good and straight now. The butterfly is really cool and supportive. All right. So now if I'm happy with this, I am going to key this looks really good you, it looks good on your on your way on your end yep I'm gonna key this one for 60 seconds now Thank you, thank you. I'm so excited because the thing is the nail is simple. I was like, okay, I'm gonna do a simple nails. 
It's really cool, it's dramatic. So if you are doing it, something similar, I'd love to see your beautiful works because I know you can really rock this one. Angie, hello, hello. Thanks so much for tuning in. So when you do that, you wanna make sure you like have turned the clients hands back and forth so then it can cure right on the edges of the rose, like 3D roses. So then that way it will not, it's full cure completely. And the longer the clients weighing it, the harder it will get. Look at that it's like concrete it doesn't do move anywhere at all we're gonna definitely doing it like um should we do like the line highlights for this just make that how it's straight huh? because you do it like this your fly will just choke up like you're falling back. Oh no, it's flat. Oh, it's straight. Yeah. It's perfect straight. Just how I show the nails, I think. Ta da! Four nails. Should we put the highlights on it? If you would like to see it, let me know because I'm going to do the butterflies on this one. And. Condensed blue gels again. Really thick density, and I am going to apply it on that. I want to think of should I do a smaller butterflies? Maybe I should. I might put some smaller butterflies. This one, that cool smaller one. Right here, the newest collection. Just to get a little bit of compliments on it. And then I am go ahead and using my condensed glue gel. I just open it and it's right on my side, right here. to apply that one first. We give a little bit more on that area that I am the spot that I'm gonna put that on. And the no white top coat. How's everyone doing on Monday? Floating on the top. So cute. And move it up. And we're using precision glue to seal so nice. 
of the shoulder. And in the meantime, I am not going to And just tiny bit of two um, crystals on that two butterflies right there. I'm probably using size SS5. That's the one I'm using it right now. Here's a look. So we're going to keep this one. And that's the thumbs on the other one. Thank you, Renee. Eric's five of us with the so you keep out to 10 seconds and after that you're gonna turn the hands back and forth make sure you ask the clients when you're doing a bigger crystal which is 3d or like cluster or pointed backs however you call and that way it will help to keep from edges like on the corner, different angle of the um, 3D crystals and uh, 3D handcrafted flowers, butterflies. It's really cool. So realistic. Hey, thanks Zoe. I'm so glad you like it. And let's do a uh, condensed glue gel, a uh, precision glue gel, I'm sorry, on all of them. Yeah. Let me move this one on the side. So I'm gonna using this. Oh, thank you, Laurie. Thank you, Zoe. Here, perfume is perfume. Perfumista. Yeah. Hey, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm gonna go between the crystals. You only feel it in when you feel scratchy. I can feel it right here. It's had the edges that is missing with condensed glue gels. Just simply that, just because of the structural C curve of the nails. Um, I really like those nails. I don't know, every time we do something fun with live tutorial about my nails and we um, like to come up with something. Okay, I wanna seal this. I wanna seal completely her. Oh, the base is really good though. You don't feel scratchy at all. 
on those 3D flowers. It's really smooth and slick on the base, which is good. And I'm gonna seal this wing right there. I wanna make sure I'm seal that really well. Sometimes if you're doing for yourself, you just have to check double time. Like if you do for the clients, you can see it so much better and a different angle. But if you do for yourself, it's gonna be a little bit different. So I keep moving my hands a lot because I just have to make sure that I can access into that angle so that I can seal it. All right. Let me flash cure this one quick. And then I will do on the thumbnails. Uh, nails by May. This is a precision glue gels. And this is a thinner viscosity uh, density compared to our condensed glue gel. So we're using this for all the flat backs and 3D crystal, which is you can see that all the big flowers and crystals. Um, and then you using after you cure that, you're gonna using um, precision glue. This one, the other end is a brush underneath here on the other end. And you're gonna seal in between all the cracks, like all that gap edges and cracks between crystals. So then it will prevent from catching on the hair or clothes or anything else. So on the other end is a brush. I'm gonna open one, the other ones. So the other end is a brush. So here's really cool, cause I'm gonna show you. See we have that open. And this one is really cool because I can using this brush and seal completely like have uh, Bella gets a great idea. She's like soak it in in uh, dip it in in condensed glue gel to prevent it from tarnish or you can do this seal that and then on the other end you can use it to seal all the edges and anything you're missing, like if you're missing right here, I'm gonna seal it and I'm coming back and I check it again if still need to seal in because if you fill it them all in and the edges, they will not gonna get catching on anything. Like this one, a little bit right there. I feel like I want, but then here let me show you some cool tip and trick because I feel like I want the couple crystals right here. I'm gonna to put it in this cute butterfly because they look like they are being blown out by so much crystals. I'm gonna seal using my Precision glue gels pens I have. Squeeze in a little bit um, glue gels and place them in in the meantime. So now I'm go ahead and gear for 60 seconds. And this one I can add a couple more ones in here too. One. And in the meantime, you still turn it back and forth. You are very welcome, May. Thanks so much for tuning in. Yep, so this is why is um, a lot of clients were afraid of to getting the cute crystal on because it's gonna keep coming off or catching on their hair or their clothes. This um, bestie will really sew the frames, and we've been using it and share and introduce and have a lot of tutorials for this almost three years now. So you can 
you can look in our IGTV and um, see all of the tutorials that we've been doing for all crystal placements. Like you name it, so it's from flat back to 3D, all different designs incorporated with so many different like crystals, 3D, flat back, charm and chains. This one will seal all the chains as well. We're using that chains with a lot of tutorials so you can check them out on our IGTV. I can't wait to go back. I almost wrapped this one on my roses, but this time my nails is short. And compared to the longer nail you see on Instagram, it's short. But for a normal day wear, for the color clients it's on, it's a good length. Um, I do a lot of like longer, longer lengths as well. So, hi, Baranko. Hello, how are you? And then if I feel here, I can continue to seal it until I completely um, feel that edges. Oh, I just dropped that. Can you take care of it? Thing like that. I'm con continue like the same thing if you do for the clients you're gonna continue to make sure you get all seal it completely for them this is like really important because you don't want to seal it one time and then you send the clients home because I usually doing it and I tell the clients can you check run through your hair or see or touch it see you feel like it catching on you let me know right away because I can absolutely do it right now before you leave and you don't have to do it all at once you can do it like one at a time you do one layer first and you will here you don't have to be full here you can do flash here and then after that why this one is like I don't know why the paper is like moving up. Okay, good. So, I have my ginger brush right here. I'm gonna blend all of this if just in case that extra of precision glue blend it so it looks so nice here it's again also check all of this if you feel any scratchy absolutely should I do some liners on this uh, I can do highlights on this one this one in gold And I will do this one like the same as this or a different flower. Or maybe I should do a different roses. Mm -hmm. Like a rose charm. You get one rose charm with that. Mm -hmm. Well, I do one and add a 3D. Yeah. yeah, rose charms. Already have a charms on it. You want a crystal? Mm hmm. So the other one doesn't have crystals, so I add crystal on, but then once it's the charms have the crystal, so you see a difference if you want to see it. I know, right, Laurie? Yes, it's make it so much better now. It makes our lives so much better. Is right close to the mess so I'm gonna do this and then after that we're gonna do the other ones I am using gold gel painting so you can continue to check if you feel like really this one feels smooth to me so this edges of the butterfly feels feel smooth to me and if you feel anything it's really really like scratchy you can absolutely seal it in until you feel completely so you don't seal, feel anything. If you still feel smooth to you, it's good. If you feel like it's still sketchy, then just 
you're gonna add um, some more precision glue this one I'm gonna shake it really well and you're gonna get most of it off from your brush Can you see it? using it just for the outline you don't have to do it like a lot hold on I'm gonna move just a little bit more Okay, I'll be right back. I'm back. Pick up some more gels painting. Hold on, I couldn't see on Instagram. Can you see it when I'm doing it like this? There you go. It looks like uh, the comments just covers them. you go I can't wait to see your beautiful creation okay I'm gonna do this maybe you can see it better so now I have to adjust in it Eric we definitely gonna tune in There you go. I'm so obsessed with this flower. I wear pom pom. I wear like uh, spinnings. Now you see me wear this 3D flowers all the time. I can't wait to have mine on. See that one. So when you kind of highlight this, just pick a little bit of gel painting. You don't want to do a big fluff of it because they might be too much for this as it's really delicate and smaller detail. There you 
There you go. Do you like it better? Yeah? All right, and then now we tear this. Hold this now. Oh, the outline. Thank you, Janae. I like it too. And then we do this one in this colors. We have the white to this. Ah, I have the mid color, but this one looks good, huh, for fall? Okay, so debating. This one have the charms on it. And this one doesn't have. I like them both they're different this is super cute though you have to see it when I put it on so I want to do two different ones so you can see that how it looks on it maybe I should do this and I can have more crystal on this one as well like this crystals on you know oh that's gonna be so cool it's gonna be everything Yes, it makes a little gold butterflies pop. Hi, Rosie. Hey, hey, how are you? Done. I feel it's so fancy. This nails. So I put some cuticles oil. Let me put some cuticle oil. So then it doesn't look like uh, dry. But yes, Laurie, stay tuned. We're gonna definitely gonna have a lot of like tutorials for poly gels, liquid and powder. Eric's keep us posted when you are going live. So we're definitely gonna tune in. I'm so excited because So when you take pictures, if you do this, and when you take picture, make sure you have to you moist the client's cuticle and remove all the excess oil. So then when you take a picture, it doesn't look like a whole um, bottle of the oil to get in it and take it away from your beautiful like design. So here's a look. I can't even see the Facebook and Instagram because the lighting. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so now I am think I'm not in Instagram. There you go. Well, it's not moving yet. There you go. Yeah. Does that look good? It's yes, under now? So now look on this. There you go. <laughs> so funny. This is two of size. What is this? You wanna see this one too? We're gonna do that once. Good. And I am going to using this. It's my condensed glue gel. Gonna be opposite because I am doing my 
using my non-dominant hands doing for my dominant hand. Really cool. This 3D is flat, so it's so easy to apply it on. So I'm gonna do it in math of condensed glue gel. Not too thick, not too thin. And a no wipe top coat. Hello Facebook and Instagram. Thanks so much everyone for tuning in today. Today's sessions again is my nails. You see, I would do my nails every two weeks, but I would like to see like our trifecta which is condensed glue gel no wet top coat and precision glue how long it lasts probably i would go into like five weeks or six weeks easily but i didn't want to look a mess Just when i doing a live video for you, all of you but you can see they are last i just took it off next time i should save it so then i can show you to take it off too I want to scratch it. So this one doesn't matter. You can do is up this way or down. What do we do? Up or down? Hmm? Down. The petals. This. Which one? That. Ah. Uh, don't touch. Don't touch. Don't touch. Big petal go down. Okay. Big petals. That is cool though. It has the little big petals there. And it have the crystal on the sides. So you can do it up and down, it doesn't matter. You decide where you want to place it. It's heavy. There you go. Ah, looks good. Okay, I can't see it because I'm from here. Maybe I should be in the middle. There you go. It's heavy. And then I am going to. Are you trying to get the flash key? Yeah, flash key is here. Uh, it's, you see how I'm doing it? The left is too for the right. <laughs> now I'm eating the other ones away. So probably I want to shift flash key down. But I'm so stubborn and say the flash key. But when you do for clients, do flash key at first. Do not try to do it like me. Because it's my nail, so. I'm trying to decorate it on the base right now. It looks super cute, though. You will see it. Okay, I can't see it from here. All right. okay as long as I don't move my hand it should be okay so I keep it safe flat oh, I can't see it there you go Super cute. Let's see if I can slide this one in. Oh no. Let do a big piece. Big piece right 
I mean, they can't see it. Okay. I will show you just a little bit on the side. It looks so cool, though. And we'll put the pumpkin spine on the side. Can I see it? You can't see it. Okay, that's what I want. Okay. Yep, more pumpkin spines. It's funny, I feel like I'm doing my own nails and I hold my breath because I feel like that. But if you do with the clients doing the rows first and then flash key, do not hesitate to like doing the flash key first just because I am my nails, so. I will adjust my head just a second. Can you see it with my hands moving in that direction? Can you check them with the Instagram? Can you see? Yep. Okay. And it looks like this. So let me cure it so then you can absolutely see it better on the side. Looks stunning. Okay, I'm gonna cure it first. Uh, maybe one smaller bit. This nail is fun. Just one bit right now. All right, so I'm gonna key it first. Me it straight. That's so good. So you key it for about 10 seconds. If you need to adjust anything, you do it right away. If not, then you're good to go. Hmm? I love this nail. Yes. Thank you so much, Fifim.
It looks so much better in person instead of just on the, on the camera. Just really stay concrete. And then you can absolutely like seal it in again with precision glue and outline this one. Oh, here I can do one hand, both hand like that. Just top bottom. Top and bottom. Thank you, Eric. I know, it's just it's really fun for the fall. Here is the nails. You can outline this one too. Absolutely outline this using your goal. Wanna see me outline this using my left-handed? Should I? I'm gonna try it. It's struggle for doing your own nails, but I'm loving it. But if you try to avoiding a lot of mistake by getting a lot, like clean the brush pretty much to have few of them, like a little bit left. So then you can, hey, thank you Dom on Facebook. Uh, okay, I think there you go. A little bit of shimmer is good. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so I'm pick up some more gel painting from my precision gel painting precision brush. I can see it straight and see I can see that one. How long if you're doing your own nails, how long did it take you to do a set of your own nails? If I do my nails, my dominant hand doing it for my like left hand, is one hand will take me maybe half an hour, and the other one might take an hour. Because using your left hand, you want to take time. You don't want to do it rush because then it will be. This one here. I couldn't see it down here, so that's why I need to move my hand. Pick up more gel painting. And then touch it right there. another one down here and down here down here another one but okay hold on I will show you the side of this rose so super cute okay I'm gonna of course I'm gonna key it but you can see look at that I dress it up with butterflies and the charm right there and now we're gonna cure this quick flash cure for 30 seconds and then we'll do precision glue on all of them all of this flowers in the meantime you can enjoy my the others hand
Look at all that. <laughs> Thank you so much. I don't know. I think I just, I just so enjoying it, and then just um, trains my. So when is like basically when the left hand's working is your right brain's. Okay, so you're, when you're using your left hand, your right, your right. Oh, hold on. Your brain on the right side working. And like reverse is your right hand working. No, right? Not really. Is it really? I think no, so. No, it's one for art and one for logic. No. So your right brain is for art, the left brain for arts. So one for logic, one for art. One more creative, one more logical. So I will never be creative because I'm a right hand. No, not, not necessarily. Because the right hand is your left brain working. No, you just use different part of your brain. But usually lefty is a little, little bit more creative than righty. So I enough. will be never creative. But it doesn't matter. Plenty of good people with right hand they can still draw. Okay. Left art, right logic. Hey, Dom, is that right? <laughs> you and you have got it right. Right? Left art right logic so you must be a left-handed Tom is that right is you so artistic anybody can be anything you just got to put your mind to it yeah Tom makes it left art right logics so you are left-handed Dom all right so you and he were the same team he's lefty mm -hmm. So anybody is right hand or oh, left hand? Oh, skin shabby cheeks. You are left hand. It's like you know what? My older sister is left handed, uh, left handed, and then my younger sister and my younger brothers. But then they all write on the right hand. Uh, when they was uh, in school, they're not allowed to. I'm using a precision glue right now. And when they was at school, they're not allowed to write on the left hand, so they have to force to be right on the right hand. So, but they do everything else in the left handed. You know what? I think I'm gonna put one beads in here. Hold on, from the picker. Lefty are in their right mind. Yeah, that's why I was saying earlier here. So they are uh, like really good in the right brain. So, mm, is I'm a right handed. So I'm gonna add it in. It's really cool because this precision glue gave me so much of. Um, Back up. Well, how I saying it? Look at that. It makes it even better. Let me see if I can find some more spot to add more beats in. Okay, I'm gonna flash gear quick because it's kind of big beats. You can do anything with between 10 seconds or 30 seconds so it's not running. And then after that, you can seal it in and spoon here 60 seconds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if someone asks the story behind your bling out. And see, oh, no. did you make the bling too? Yeah. So, yes. This is a brush that she just never used much. She bling it out using all the old crystal that is just not good enough to sell to you guys. So we just use all of them and bling them out. Okay, it's a story about this. I have four or five different brush I did. What we do is it in the warehouse, when we get all the crystal, we're selecting them. Not good quality or is manufacturer defects. And then we are selecting it out. And I like to collecting it. You can see that, hold on, don't spin it. Um, okay, you just spin something. 
So if you see that just a little bit cracks right here or whatever is somehow, um, I collecting them just for fun because I like to put it in. I can do the the full blue ones, but it's cool to have this one to place it in here to just like because they're so beautiful and then somehow some way they got a little bit of um, defect and. I want to place them here so then they still have an, the second chance to shy. Just me. Uh, what is it called that? It's uh, mm -hmm. I just like that. I don't know. I just don't want them to be like useless. So they all sparkle and they're all shiny. So I don't know. I feel like you're talking about Toy Story. <laughs> because it was like so sad if they're being abandoned. <laughs> So I give it another chance to shy. Hey, thank you, Dom. We'll try, we'll try the best. And so that's why I play, I like that. So if you, it's funny, there's a lot of friends that who is going to show and say, oh my God, it's so sparkly. If you look closer, they're not like 100% perfect. But they really shine when they're all together. So you can't really tell until I show really the details on it. So I'm gonna do, Precision glow. I have a lot of them. Like some of them are is not perfect. You can't sell or ship it to your clients. So uh, how about let me seal this. Seal that one right there. I'm on brush and on that one too. Seal this one so it's not gonna tarnish, get tarnished from the wear. All of the right here. And I'm a big one right there. Yeah. And this one right there. I will move everywhere. Sorry if I can't show you. Okay, here, you can go back over and over. So this is really high E creations. Unavoidable. Okay, what is it? I have forced to use both hands for about 15 years seeing it with also licensed massage therapist. Mm, thank you for playing. Is my other hand. Thanks so much for tuning in, Creations. Oh, it's really cool. So it just um, always remind yourself, even though you're busy, make sure you get some time for yourself, and do some even simple nails. Like this is like just a lot of people were asking to want to see that um, 3D handcrafted flowers with incorporate with metal or butterflies so I'm showing but if you even like using all of your um, stickers and then dress your nails up really nice for a fall and the, when the clients come in for your appointment they're like oh my god I want to get that too you can see that so let me make sure you check check and then see if anything that you need to to um, seal it you can do that as well There you go. Hey, Keja, how are you? Thanks so much for tuning in, and please stay tuned for is virtual church shows coming on the way, and a lot of news is products and you think is on the way as well. So after you all done, you can you can check if you feel any scratch. It feels so smooth in this, you know, and if you feel any scratchy, you can absolutely keep sealing it until you get until you get the um you when you feel it and you don't feel any scratchy at all then how would I get that can you do a straight on the phone so I move it with the straight on the phone yeah 
I keep it off while you just see it for a second. Is that what it's got now? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Two different flowers, one with charm, but I add more crystal on it anyway. Good tip about your nails being advertising. Yes, absolutely, Lori. You are very welcome. Janae, okay, so I keep calling Janae. You pronounce your name Janae or Jenny? It should be Janae, right? Yeah, Eric's virtual chit shows. Uh, only once. Hey, this one is, you know what? I used to do it and it take me good about an hour to do one flowers. If it faster, then it might depend. But this is from ours is if you're checking on our website, official website, glitzaccessoryandsuch.com, um, only one, uh, you will see that all of handcrafted uh, flowers, butterflies you see in my hands and so many much like so many more of handcrafted like we have totally of 30 different kinds and then it keep dropping um in every week so you can see from bows butterflies a different type of flowers and then you will see bows uh 3d roses you see uh is uh what is that? Fairy, fairy wings, leaves. It's super cute, super cute. You check it out. And every single of them, every single petals is, was, is sculpting by like glitz team. I mean, by human hands, not mass production. So you have to see in person. Let me move it up closer. It's really detailed and it's so realistic. Thank you so much, Skin Shabby Chic. Hello. I think I moved that already. I don't know. Let's go with this one. Mm -hmm. Too much to do this. There you go. There you go. I feel like I have my hand cooked it. Yeah, the good Shafita, 3D Rose in $5 nail art. Yes, thank you so much, Dom. If anyone have a questions at all, all the products, you can find it on our um, official website. A lot of them are fun nail arts will be on the $5 nail art section. However, if season's coming, as you, when you go in to click on either in your mobiles when you're shopping or on your laptop or your uh, computers, you will see the top it was is showing Halloween and Christmas special check on that as you see all that Halloween and Christmas is related and we start doing a lot of tutorials um, incorporates with Halloween and Christmas special with so many different charms stickers designs including th uh, 40 uh, weaver gels with all different, like Weaver Gel have so many different colors. It fit with all different seasons. And you were also seeing a lot of nail art charms that we're gonna using in $5 nail art sections because a lot of requests and inquiries for the tutorial regarding to that. And a lot of other, check that out. If you want, really want some fun nail arts under $5 or under is in category $5, check that one out also. Is one really cool thing if you want to check glitz out using um, check out on our section of treasure bags and then treasure box. So if you want to get something is really cool, the value of treasure box over one hundred and twenty dollars with a lot of uh, products that is randomized from our whole total of collections in and tie the website. And you'll get randomly a really good trendy products and all the total value of 120 
over $120, but you only get it for, you only pay for $49.99. There are different theme and different seasons right now. It's going on right now. It's really cool. Everybody love, love uh, Halloween treasure box. It has so many in there. So check that one out because we'll only run for the season unless we have a lot of people request. Now we still have people request for a Valentine treasure box. Easter treasure box, you'll be surprised because they love it. Because something to be on the um, Valentine, Easter... And then there are uh, press-ons and glue-on treasure box. And you will see summer treasure box. And then you will see, because that's really stunning, because if you're looking to that, each of them have really cool tools in there, which is either condensed glue gels or precision glue. Something, something that you can really absolutely enjoying it. And um, Diamond is Pixie. And in uh, Halloween, we have exclusive is Diamond Dust Pixies on that one as well. It has a lot of like, uh, stickers for and Halloween also encapsulating and Halloween mix bag. So with stunning a lot of cool crystals in there. And or if you like want to test it out or check it out, so you can always um, check it out on the treasure bags, which is a value of forty dollars, and you only get it for you only pay for nineteen ninety nine, and it has a lot of cool things in there as well. So check this one out, Jane, Jane, Janie. Hold on, do I say it right, Janie? Janie, is that right? Did I? Pronounce it right, mm -hmm. Janie. Right here, she's coming. Janae. 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 Janae Sue. So I call you right, right? I pronounce it right. So I think I somehow that's why it's not going up to date. Hey, thanks so much to all new one. Yes, Janae. So I call you right all the time. I just make sure I call you right because oh, someone was telling me that it's calling your names not right. So I say, ah, oh, I, I call it right. Yep, yeah, it's Janae. Janae. Yep, that is, you cannot read that. It's Janae. It's Janae. Yeah, that's why I was like, but I just still want to ask. Thank you so much. <laughs> if not, then you would like help me and correct me right away. So this basic set. I think it's just two roses make it so different. It just makes the sets really pop, I guess. But I also adore like um, butterflies. This one is really cool though. I'm gonna try to see if I get it right in the under the camera. Here is a thumb. Ones with 3D. Handcrafted and one with the stickers. Looks so cool. Love this set. Thank you, Janae. I love it too. <laughs> Bingo. Look at this. I dressed this roses base up really fancy. It doesn't look like plain Jane at all. Like it's just I dress it up so you don't feel. Perfect. Awesome. So I would definitely see everyone tomorrow. I think we're going to do some uh, chapter for the big uh, butterflies. Hola. Hello. How are you? Thank you, Skin Shavishik. Hey, thank you, thank you. Yes, so Eric will keep us posted for whenever he's go live and then stay tuned for our virtual treat shows, our team preparing it and it's gonna be so much fun and gonna be events like so much more fun than the last time we have. And I'm looking forward to to um get, you know, to bring a lot of cool techniques, products and funds, a lot of a lot of 
giveaway doing that um, virtual church show as well. So please stay tuned. Thank you so much, everyone. Just any uh, products that we're using, you can absolutely find it on our website, goodsuccessinsuch.com, and also a lot of fun art that I'm using on under $5 now art sections. And I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Hope you enjoyed this. And um, I will see you tomorrow. Have a good night, everyone. Please stay safe. Love you all. Bye-bye.